Hello everybody, my name's Becky and I'm currently visiting every single state park in Florida. There's 175 of them. I think this is like 107 or something like that. And today we're with my dad and his dog. We are at Terracia Preserve State Park, which is mostly water, but there is a trailhead and that's, that's the technicality of my visit this time. Terracia is the swampy mangrovey land just south of the Sunshine Skyway Bridge, just south of the mouth of Tampa Bay. So let's see what there is to discover here today. Wow, that's a lot of trails. And they're probably not underwater right now. Oh, because it's the dry season. I mean, that's probably just permanent there. <laughs> what? Plus, I've got my mud and shoes on. All right, let's just take a little walkie. Walkie poop. Oh, it's uh, a blazed trail. Nice. Just because it looks like there's a palm hammock. Look at that. Look at all these fire scorched palm trees. Interpretation plaque. I know what that interpretation plaque is. That's the shaped by fire plaque. That one's everywhere. Well, I think we lucked out. It's spring, it's not quite summer yet, which means that it's not so wet yet. And it's also not so buggy yet. I think probably most of the year, this trail system is probably mostly mud and um, completely inundated with mosquitoes and noceums and other biting insects. But we had a lovely walk this morning. We're also gonna be visiting the Judah P. Benjamin Confederate Memorial at Gamble Plantation Historic State Park. <laughs> These kinds of museums are always a good reminder that Florida was definitely part of the South and had plantations of slavery. It's springtime in South Florida, which means the poisonous caterpillars are out. And look at this wall. It's absolutely lousy with them. If you ain't from Florida, please take this warning. Do not get near or touch these. They will leave angry welts on you for weeks. It's terrible. It feels like shingles. Ugh. They fall off at trees too. Look at all this Florida snow. This little purple wildflower is called Florida snow. And it tends to bloom in the winter. You know, like snow. One of the things I just learned at the visitor center of the Judah P. Benjamin Confederate Memorial at Gamble Plantation Historic State Park is that the ranger told me they don't make the Florida State Park passport anymore. That seems tragic. They said there wasn't enough demand. I don't know about that. Anyway, I feel very lucky that I got mine before the pandemic, but the guy at the visitor center, the ranger who gave me the stamps was like, from what I can tell, there's lots of demand, so kind of a bummer. Um, everybody should reach out to the De Department of Environmental Protection at the State Parks of Florida and say, bring back the passports. 
and we're also going to be visiting Madeira Bickle Mountain State Park. Madeira Bickle Mound State Archaeological Site. Enjoy a picnic and discover the first Native American site in Florida designated a state archaeological site donated by Carl and Madeira Bickle. In 1948, this park features a flat-topped ceremonial mound composed of sand, shell, and village debris over a 100 by 170 foot base towering over 20 feet tall. Towering, towering. over 20 feet tall. Excavations have disclosed at least three periods of Native American cultures dating back over 2,000 years. Now that's great. And it's raining, so let's go. as far north as these trees grow. And this one doesn't seem to be growing. Not anymore. Oh, there's one. They call it the tourist tree because it looks like it's sunburned. Enough of an adventure for you today, Daddy. You ready to go to the ham dealership? <laughs> park is really just like a 15 minute visit but uh, I came here because my dad's never come here and it's only like 45 minutes from his house so all right that's it three short visits to state parks that I've already been to but I did not have the stamp for very satisfying stuff I just counted and I'm currently at 111. 111 out of 175. If you'd like to follow along with me visiting every single 175 Florida State Parks, hit subscribe. And if you enjoyed this video, or if you enjoyed Maggie's smiling face, hit like. Thank you.